Welcome everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play RimWorld. We're in a bit of a pickle. And with a bit of a pickle, I mean a hell of a lot of trouble. Um, we have just agreed to um, give she, the joy writer, uh, joy wirer actually, <laughs> here a um, shel shelter. Unfortunately, she's being um, hunted by these pirates. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. One of them has a sniper rifle, one of them has a triple rocket launcher, uh, and two of them have pistols and one of them has grenades. Needless to say, uh, we're in a lot of trouble. I have no idea how we're gonna do this. I'm placing another turret here, well I've placed it last time, but it will need components and steel and we don't have enough steel so they would need to bring it from all the way... Actually, no. None of it has been, um, mined. So never mind that. Um, I can just cancel this because we're not gonna do that. <sighs> this is bad. Right, we've got Lazy at the ready here. Uh, who else can, can also shoot? Uh, I guess Prometheus. We can get Prometheus over here to maybe help. Uh, David is Melly. He can, uh, he can hide over here somewhere to try and, uh, shoot these guys. But I don't know. Th this is gonna be this is gonna be bad. All right, guys, get ready. Nobody else has weapons, and Shiori doesn't really do anything. Playing billiards, brilliant. You know, go and play billiards while we're uh, gonna get killed over here. Come on, shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay. No, I don't care about that one. I wanted to hit that one with a sniper rifle. Oh no! Go and shoot the one with the rocket launcher. Oh, nice. Okay, okay, nice. Excellent. Almost dead. Come on. Where's Crystal going? Flee! Uh-oh. He's attacking. Uh-oh. What's that guy doing? He's shooting. Uh-oh. He's shooting. He's shooting. That's not gonna be good. <gasps> he's shooting. Oh, he's shooting. Oh, bloody hell! Well, he killed one of his own pirates, um, Anon, boss. Uh, Doc, the scientist over here, is um, wounded. We could actually... <laughs> she's cowering. We could actually capture him, but in this... Well, actually, why not? Go and capture him right away. Uh, Steven over there is shooting at us. Yeah, might, might not be the best idea. Who are you shooting at? Death? What's Death doing there? Forget about repairing, just get out of there. Go! Bloody hell. Where's the guy with the- oh, ouch. Lazy got hit there quite badly. Gunshot, left leg. Oh, yeah, this is really not a good idea. Get away! Oh, Crystal got shot. Where's Monifix going? Hauling. Y you know what? We kind of have a situation here. Get out of there. Get him. Lazy will have to get out of there soon. Oh, nice! <gasps> They're fleeing! We did it! Yeah, we did it! Oh, I can't believe we did it! We actually did it! Come on, shoot him! Ah, uh, you're not gonna get him? That sniper rifle would be nice. Damn. Okay. These guys don't need to be, uh... Drafted anymore. Oh no, that was so close. We could have gotten that sniper rifle. Oh, never mind now. Oh my god, I can't believe we actually did that. Look at that. That got completely destroyed. Um Wow. And we got a prisoner as well. That's quite interesting. Well, we'll try to recruit him. That was amazing. Uh, let's give him no, let's give him normal medicine, or just best quality medical care. We're gonna try to uh, recruit him anyway, so let's let's see what his skills are. Shooting 11, research 15. Wow. I can't believe we actually did that. With that rocket launcher and, you know, so many people, I was almost sure we were gonna... We were gonna die here. Horribly. Um, but that was quite amazing, I have to say. That thrombo over there, bloody hell. If somebody... If someone stray shot had, uh, hit that thrombo, we would have had it, probably. <clears throat> right, so let's see, Monifix has been... has a gunshot on his torso, ouch. 
There we go. Well, Lazy is enjoying the, um... Tons of joy. There we go. The television. Witness outsider's death. I saw someone die. They were alive one moment and dead the next. Well, there you go. Right. <clears throat> Let's also pick that up. Uh, what are they wearing? Poor, shoddy. Eh, I'm not going to bother with that. Yeah, I'm not going to bother with that either. I'm just going to leave it. So that was quite interesting, actually. Um, right, and now we have a new arrival. And a, a, another one, I guess. So, Shiori is going to be known as... Fodder. Oops. Sorry, gave it away now. Fodder! Welcome to the colony, Fodder! Well, that just means that we need more dusters. We need two more cowboy hats, two more dusters, and... Well, we'll leave the t-shirts for now. That was awesome. I like the fact that we have so much medicine as well, though. You know. That was cool. A rocket launcher, man. What the bloody hell? That was crazy. Well, I guess there's no repairing that. There's only st slag chunks. That does kind of hurt because, um... It did cost 240 steel and three components, so... Yeah. Not great. So this is the dumping area. I guess we'll just, uh... Tell the guys to take this away. Well, that was pretty cool, though. I have to say, I, um, you know, I've never had such a large force attack my colony. As I said, you know, you might be saying, Oh, that's nothing, I've seen this and that, and yes, I believe you, but uh, the thing is, um, I usually just played on, like, free play or, you know, somewhere where there was, like, one person attacking with a club, and that was it. You know, nothing major at all. Because I just prefer um, playing the game like that. Uh, let's see his health. Gunshot, gunshot, gun... Ooh, right kidney. Ouch. Well, poorly sutured. Let's see if that can heal. <clears throat> wow. They're repairing that for a long time. Look at that. Can you guys just take that away? So we don't have to watch this bloody corpse? Consume human corpse. Reserved by Monifix. <laughs> He's going to eat it. Overlord. Eight without table, observe two corpses, ugly environment, and a little pain, feeling terrible, in darkness. Yeah, well, you know, we'll be fine. Oh, where did this steel come from? From the destroyed turret? That's interesting. It's very possible. Right. So, we have just one extra t uh, bed for Doc over here. Uh, which means we'll have to make more stuff, more... Uh, more areas for these guys. I guess we'll place them here. Wood, please. Alright, so let's see. These are a little... No, these won't be cramped because they'll be larger. Like this. Uh, like so. I guess. Will this one be a little cramped? I don't know. Yeah, cramped environment. Mm, okay, fine. We'll change it then. We'll make it a little larger. Yeah. Uh, there. Larger rooms! Or maybe, actually, like this. I know, I know, I'm changing my mind, but there you go. There, that should be fine. And of course, we need some doors. Uh, one door here. Um, actually, this is going to be the hot part. No. I want a wooden door here. Disease. Probably the guy we captured. Oh no, Overlord. What happened? What? Oh no, that's poor mood. Doc has gotten sick from infection. The infection is in his torso. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll need to treat that. But well, that's fine. Military turret gun. <laughs> there you go. Uh, we'll need to treat that because... Um, I mean, we can treat that because we have a lot uh, of medicine left. So that's fine. There we go. Father is already going there to uh, take care of him. And she's wearing normal stuff. Excellent. And a toque. Or toque or whatever it's called. There we go. 70%, not too bad, but, well, 
<clears throat> Poorly bandaged. Prometheus is gonna drink some beer. Wow. Well, anyway, we're we're gonna place another turret here. Uh, what are we researching? Hospital bed. I really want those um, <clears throat> new extra turrets. I'm just thinking, maybe we should make like a corridor to this turret. Block everything else off and just make a corridor where they can come in. I don't know. Could work, maybe. Or maybe they'll just mine through, uh, you know, through walls and that's it. Me, me. Oh, more medicine is gonna be ready. Nice. Very cool. Make runner. Oh, nice. The runner has been complete. Let's uh, install it. Well, I could install it here. Um, mm, yeah, let's install it there. Why not? Or like one here. I'll just install it there. Alright. I think we'll need some more uh, wood as well, so we'll need to chop down some. There's a lot of wood here. Should be quite handy. I wonder when, when that marriage is going to take place. David is making some uh, medicine. It's nice. I really, I have to say, I really do enjoy the mods. They, I don't know, for some reason, they actually feel like they're part of the vanilla game. Probably because the game isn't very graphically um, um, demanding, you know, as far as sprites go. I mean, of course, you have to make them look nice. And these, these tables look like they're sort of, you know, part of the game. This one is maybe a little bit wonky, because it almost seems like flat. Um, but yeah. I mean, I really enjoy the mods. They're, they're nice. They're fine. Let's have some wooden floors here. I guess we ran out of uh, wood. There. And of course, this is where uh, we'll also need to have the... Maybe just put some vents over here. Because we have three. Oh yeah, these need to cool everything down. Okay. Maybe I'll just put a uh, cooler over here. Mm, like so. And it's going to cool uh, these two places. <clears throat> there. I think that will be fine. Are they cutting down the trees? Yes, they are. Prometheus is doing that. Prometheus seems to be the one um, cutting all the trees down. There's some turkey eggs here. Which I guess it's better if we take them inside. Just in case. Nice. I'm still happy that we uh, got through that, and we got a prisoner, so a potential recruit. He's still sleeping. Oh, he still has that infection. Bing, and treated. And there we go, Monofix is... Oh, I thought uh, Monofix was um, coming to uh, to treat him, so somebody will need to come and treat him with, uh, with medicine right now. Ooh, 2.5% chance, that was very low. Actually, does he have any social report built? Hard worker versus lazy? No. Okay. That's fine. A <laughs> woman, minus 25. Does he not like women? I guess. Uh, mad scientist. Stripped of his life's work and exiled after his unethical experiments on the survivors of the Callus 9 incident were published, the mastermind learned the skills necessary to survive in the Outer Rim. Continuing his research with nothing left to lose, he made minions to carry out the tasks that bored him. Wow. Um, dislikes women. Doc really dislikes and distrusts women. Doc tends to crack under pressure, and Doc has an easy time staying on task and focused and gets uh, things done much faster than the average person. Wow, 35% extra speed. Nice. Incapable of social. Well, that's gonna be interesting. He's a mad scientist. A man. Well, let's uh, haul this away because it can't really stay here. 81%. That's. Ooh. Major infection now already. See, I don't like that. Um, the infection keeps spreading and increasing in severity, despite the fact that we are following the treatment, you know? I don't know why. 
1.3% chance with Prometheus. He's going to be difficult to uh, recruit, I guess. Okay, these two places... Oh yeah, they're still unroofed. So uh, they'll need to do that. And I will also... Oh yeah, I need to get more steel. I can't... I can't... Believe that we've gone through so much steel already. That's crazy. Well, we've got steel right here, so I don't need to go out of my way to get it. We're just gonna mine this stuff out. Look at that. Brilliant. We need to uh, replace that turret. It's a loss, but you know what? I'll take that um, lost turret any day over losing a colonist. So that was quite worth it. One fix is already up. <clears throat> oh yeah, and so is Crystal. They're they're loving. Look at that. <laughs> the status is loving. <laughs> All right. We have some uh, herbal medicine and herbal medicine there, so that's good. They can still make some medicine. Nom nom nom. There's quite a lot of people now. I like it. David is playing chess. Ah, nice. They're mining. Excellent. That's what we need. Okay, so I'm going to put a military grade turret. Oh! oh yeah, I could. Does it make any difference if I uh, place it. I, if I make it out of plastic? Will it have more uh, gold? Whoa. Will it have more um, hit points? I really doubt it. Anyway, steel it is. Severe illness. Yeah. Extreme! But that's alright, because it's at 91% immunity. So, as per usual, we've been there. Oh, hospital bed was researched. We've been there and he'll be fine. Okay, what next? Fire foam, moisture pump, blah blah blah. Simple prosthetics could be cool, but... Um, vitals monitor, there's the, the thing which increases patient's treatment quality. Uh, but what I really want right now is maybe mortars. Long distances over walls, that would be kind of cool, actually. Shredder and precision turrets. Let's do mortars for now. Wow. <clears throat> that would be crazy. Ah, excellent. Roofing is being placed down. So this place will... There you go. You can see that the uh, temperature is going down quite nicely. And Prometheus cleaning everything. All right. So let's put some uh, furniture down. Wooden beds. Uh, some lights, whoops. Let's place down one here and one here. And of course some plant pots as well. There. Alright. So we have some extra beds. You know, I always like to have extra beds um, on my colony, or in my colony. So in case we get some recruits, we they immediately have rooms and beds to stay in. And there's the turrets again. Excellent. These are actually quite useful. Despite the fact that they're not overly, um, you know, uh, accurate. I might actually place two, one side by side. I mean, two side by side. Because they don't seem to go down rather that easily. Except, of course, with a bloody rocket launcher. Uh, that's a different thing altogether. For all, or, I could do this. Place more sandbags like this and have the turret here. Um, now, of course, placing turrets down here, I'm pretty sure that I will put all the security over here and up here and then they will attack from this side or something. Well, I can't really get from the sea, I guess. I do have a lot of cattle already. Yeah, we have a lot of it. A lot of them, look at that. Lots of turkeys. Baby female turkey. Baby female turkey, one season. They're gonna take a while to uh, grow up, but yum yum yum, turkey. It'd be nice to get some chickens as well, but that's all right. All right, there we go. That other other turret is being placed down as well. Prometheus is <laughs> cleaning and vomiting because she's got food poisoning. There we go. Let's see. She's gonna vomit, and then she's gonna. No, she's not gonna clean the vomit. She's cleaning her vomit there. Attempting to recruit dog. Okay, well, you do that first. And then you'll do the whole vomit thing. 
How's our energy doing? Yeah, we're okay. Let's see the batteries. Oh, uh, yeah, they're full. So, pretty much full. 1.9%. That's not very good at all. He's in a pretty good mood as well. Hmm. Cramped environment? Here? What? Oh, because these are somewhat smaller yeah, than these. Oh, well. And that other turret is done now. Excellent. There we go. More turrets. I'll probably place another turret up here. Uh, like so. Place it here. There. I know, it's a lot of components and uh, steel, but hey, these turrets actually help quite a bit. Alright. Well, anyway. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, we have a round rug over there. Superior. That's, uh, that's ready. Nice. Anyway, I will see you next time when we, uh, when we, well, build up more stuff and more defenses. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.